but as a part again, it grows exponentially fast. And we also find explicit cycles that are responsible for that behavior. And those cycles are where the graphs show up. So I wanted to explain a bit of that. Um, the connection between Riemann surfaces and the graphs that we use
mean is there's a disk here and a disk there, and I glue the centers of the disk together to get a copy of this prototype. So that will be an example of a nodal Riemann surface. Almost a Riemann surface, except it has these local singularities. Now, to get an actual Riemann surface, I can replace replace the node. Element in H6 of 
and this turns out to be non-zero. That's an interesting matter. This was described earlier by a different method. Uh, but this commodity group is in fact non-zero. It is one-dimensional. That was calculated by Lu Yang. Yeah, that's 
10 answers. So that gives uh, 10 real parameters.
in the case of genus 5, gives a non-zero cycle in each genus. Um, okay, so the general pattern is for any odd G. Um, take another one. There are always correction terms as a wheel graph with G main spokes. Alternating 
some super edges minus one to whatever that edge is in the solid water, and then collapse that edge. <coughs> Respect the total order. That's a complicated graph. <clears throat> I sum over all possible edges and then collapsing an edge. This comes from a dimension estimate on the homology of 
the graph complex. <coughs> if I take the product over all G, this is a kind of graded object. That's an extra grading. That's the homological grading, and that's the grading by G. This turns out to have a Lie algebra structure. Um, and uh, results of other people imply that this Lie algebra contains a free Lie algebra on infinitely many generators, one in each odd degree. Where sigma g goes to this wheel graph. <coughs> this was proved by, I think, the main two people. There's one injection that's due to Francis Brown about 10 years ago into the so called broken leak type of the algebra. And then Another result of Thomas Wilbacher that established an isomorphism from the growth of the exchange with the algebra to part of this uh, graph. Okay.